all right guys so pretty much this is the uh, case that i printed last time um as you can see i couldn't get the uh, logo to print because it was very fragile and they had a lot of supports so i also didn't like the part that how it was warped and curved and it was kind of cracked so what i did is i went back and i designed it again I made these walls thinner because I think that's the reason why it was uh, warping. Uh, the thicker the material, the uh, walls are, the usually is the reason why you get some um, some warping. So I made them thinner, and I also, in order to prevent the warping over here and the curve, the curvature, I added these like legs on it. Um, you see that? It lifts them a little bit. And then also because of the walls are thinner, I didn't get any cracks. And also in order to uh, to make it a easier print job, I make this longer. So this was like a five hour job, five or six hour job. This one was like an hour and a half job. So I could do this when I was sleeping and then this one when I woke up. I also just created a, a grill in order to, uh, pre uh, to improve airflow. I'm gonna power it up. So what I found out that I didn't like about it is that whenever you have a, a USB in here or a keyboard or anything like that in here, uh, it prevents you from sending it up like this. So what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna add uh, some kind of legs or stand to make it so I can tilt it and I can stand it up away from the USBs. So um, that's gonna be my next project. Also what I did over here is that I, I installed a keyboard. So if I don't have a keyboard connected, I can use this to, uh, you know, browse the internet or do some commands. So that's my update this, this time.